So I was asked by um, my cousin <laughs> online, he said I should start doing all my videos in cosplay. Um, that's not why I'm dressed like this. I actually went to a, uh, there was a Harry Potter pop-up, or excuse me, it was a Wizarding World themed pop-up, but they didn't actually call it that because, you know, legal reasons, called uh, the Boozy Cauldron here in Lakeland. And uh, I actually had a wand made by a friend of mine, uh, Amy. She made this a long time ago and I've had it ever since, so shout out. But um, like, so anyway, I, I wanted to, I was gonna make a video about something else, but I kinda wanted to touch on that, like the whole um, boozy culture thing. I, as a fan of pop-ups, as somebody who ran a pop-up, I ran a Marvel pop-up in DC a few years back um, on the same weekend as Awesome Con, which is a, a Comic Con up there. Listen, this is pretty good. It was more like a kind of like a themed event. It was a dinner and a show. You go there and they mix potions and you had, kind of had like six drinks and they're walking you through mixing the drink, mixing the potions rather, and then like going through the whole thing. And um, it, it was really, really cool. Uh, it was, you know, like they had music going, they had like a whole, they, they, they obviously did a lot of planning and they, they did everything really well. So um, I, I really wanted to give credit to that. That was super, super cool. Uh, that's why I got this cool background. But um, in addition to that, I wanted to say like, you know, just the drinks were great. The show was great. I hope they do that again. It was great. And I know that the team, they run a couple of other uh, pop-ups here. Um, it was been, If you've ever been to downtown Lakeland, which is halfway between Tampa and Orlando in Florida, this town is a real foodie town. In the downtown area, there's a place called Fresco's, and beneath it is kind of like a, I guess you could say it's the speakeasy portion. It's not really a speakeasy. It's basically just like an event place underground, and it's kind of where the pop-up went. Um, like I said, super cool. People were in costumes. Like They had accents. They pre-planned everything. They had a whole production. It was fantastic. Uh, highly recommend it if you ever get a chance to saw it. Um, I didn't realize that I was the one who actually recommended it. Like I sent it to everybody saying I was interested or to my wife and to my sister. And then my wife went ahead and bought the tickets and we were able to go. Um, but so I, yeah, I was dressed like this with my wand and because I was one of the few people with a wand, they actually brought me up on stage and like I mixed a little drink, whatever. So whatever, that was fun. Um, and my wife was decked out and my sister, we had, it was a great time. Just gonna say it was absolutely fun. Um, on that note, if you have like, you've been to Universal Studios or you have annual passes, I have annual passes, and I'll be posting some videos on some stuff going out of the parks, they just lifted the mask mandate. So if you are outside in Universal Studios, you no longer have to wear a mask, which is great because that is, man, it was difficult. You could only like, I guess if you were stopped and you could, and you were drinking or eating, you could do that and they had like special areas, but now you no longer need a mask, um, except for indoors, you know, and, and you know, those things. but no longer need a mask, you know, in the thing. And so anyway, I just wanted to do that quick little shout out to, to the parks and to, to the Boozy Cauldron. Um, and I'm gonna be posting another video about some other stuff that's different. And uh, thanks, appreciate everybody, all the support and everything. And uh, remember, do all the little thing with those, like and subscribe, all that crap.